a little bit about the Explorer, um, the mystery boxes, um, graphic novel. This is by Abrams Publishing. Um, the it's edited by Kazo Kibushi, creator of the best-selling series Amulet, and it's good for younger readers. This is a, um, really short stories. Uh, they all have a mystery box in common. It's, um, each story has each little section has a little short story. The first one is about a girl that finds a uh, a little doll box under her bed and then the doll uh, there's some magical things that happen with the doll and um, then there's a story about a boy who also finds a magical box and tries to sell it on the internet and then wizards uh, start appear at his house and um, want to buy the box it's a fun little and here's a little bit more of an adventure story with uh, dinosaurs and he goes on a more of an outdoor adventure story. Um, so yeah, and there's not really a lot of writing. This is good for um, the younger readers that way. There's a couple of spots where um, the adults will have to walk them through some of the language. And the wording is... Uh, some of the words are a little bit larger, but as far there's not really a lot of words in the stories. It's mostly pictures, and I thought they were really cute. They they all revolve uh, around um, magical boxes that are found. Some have different creatures. Some take place in our world, and then here's the the last story is the one on the front cover. And I think this is a really good uh, starter. Uh, if your kids show some interest in comics or graphic novels, I think this is a great starter book. And they're really short stories, so you can just do one a day if you wanted to or not. And like I said, there are um, a couple stories with bigger words, but I think they can work their way through them, or you guys can help them out. It's really cute, and um, it's a fun read. So if you guys have kids or you yourself are interested in some of this, uh, my favorite, I think, as far as at least the artwork goes, is, let me see if I can find it here. I have a couple of favorites in here. I had two. And I think it's really because of the coloring. I really like bright colors. And I thought this one did a great um, use of different kind of shades of coloring in the seams and then also this one that had really bright colors I'm a fan of really bright colors those were my favorite stories and um, I really liked the artwork each each piece has diff different artwork done in it uh, varying um, varying artists and they all handle it a different way in their little story and um, how it's represented very little dialogue very little writing in it so that is my review on Explore the Mystery Boxes. Not much to go on, but it's a handful of short stories. Great for kids, great for younger readers, and um, I think it'd be a great sit-down family time book, too. So uh, anyway, uh, that's it for this one. Thanks for watching.